This is a photo filter tutorial on um, making a double background. So the first thing you want to do is open up your three images. And what we're going to do first is just make sure that they're all the same size. And we can do that by going to image size up here on top, image, and then image size. And if you're doing this with B, then you can see there's a width and a height. And all you got to do is memorize that and go to your backgrounds and go to their image size and type that in and make sure preserve aspect ratio is unchecked and press OK and it will be resized. So after you're done resizing them just take the polygon tool and trace around the person in the main image. As you can see I've already done that in advance so the first and then after that you want to press copy or control C and go to your first background and right click paste. As you can see, you can move it around, so just move it where you like. And after that, if you want to drop shadow around the person, go back to the main image and go to selection on top and copy shape. Then go back and press paste shape. And make sure it's aligned with the person here. And go to filter, stylize, and progressive contour. And you can edit the opacity and make sure outside is checked and blur is chosen. As you can see, there's a drop shadow. You can edit the width and color. I'm leaving in mine at black. So as you can see, there's a drop shadow. And after that, you take the polygon tool and you just leave a space around the person here, like so. And... Just trace around. Okay, and after that, go to copy and go to your second background. Press paste. Just move it where you would like it. Okay, now if you want to drop shadow against the first background, then go back over here and go to selection and copy shape. Go back here and paste shape. Make sure it's aligned, the selection, and go to filter and repeat pr progressive contour. Okay, and as you can see, there's, you know, a drop shadow. So that's it, and if this tutorial helped, then just comment and rate and subscribe for more tutorials. And um, if you need any help, then just ask me. So, yeah, bye.